everyone, welcome to Wow Pets by Eyes Lighting. In this video, I am going to show you the crafting of the battle pet, the Resident Echo. So this is the last two we have on our list, and I'm finishing off Shadowlands. So for this battle pet, you're going to need access to the Pet Forge, and if you don't already have it, the schematic is linked above. So you're going to need Genesis modes, you're going to need a glimmer of survival, and you're going to need the unformed lattice. So let's get started with the unformed lattice. Your best bet for this is the Adrift Cores. There's a whole bunch of them over in the Untamed Verdure, and all you need to do is go around and kill, I don't know, maybe three or four before I saw this, and I've seen it quite a few times, so either I've been really lucky or it's quite a good drop rate. So next up is the Glimmer of Survival. So this I found dropped mainly from plants or things that were taken over by plants. So for example, the autumn around the um, Catalyst Gardens, they can also drop it as well as these branch type vines or the little plants that run along the floor. On to craft time. So we don't talk about Genesis moats, it literally come from everything. There's a link above if you want to know where I was farming them. So now we have our moats, our glimmer and our lattice. All that's left to do is hit create. And like all the other ones, it drops smack straight into our bag. It is a click to learn. And once you learn it, it will look like this. And here are the spells, actions, activities, whatever it is you want to call them, that it can do as you level it up all the way to 20. And now I shall summon it so you can see what it looks like. So here is our Resonant Echo, which looks exactly like the other core type pets that we've made. It doesn't look anything different or echoey or anything special in my mind. So anyway, as always, Thanks for watching, I hope you found this video useful and subscribe to see what else I'm up to.